What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So, I had to talk about this one. This this right here is the definition of someone that's for the streets. Take that back. Take that back. She's not for the streets. She's for the pipes and the sewage under the streets. If you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about this this uh woman here she goes by uh Brittany Renner uh she uh has been the topic of discussion a few times this year um she was recently dating uh, in a relationship with a uh, basketball player uh by PJ Washington now <clears throat> here's the thing about this situation I gotta bring up some uh information before we get to this clip right here basically pj was you know pretty much i guess fell in love with uh miss britney renner here and i'm sure a lot of people that know him a lot of people that may not have known him i'm sure someone has reached out to him and said something to the lines of Yo, I don't think she's the one, my guy. She's not the one, coach. You can, you know, have a good time with her, but I don't think you should be getting her pregnant. I don't even think you should be cuffing her. She's not the one. She's she's someone you definitely want to stay away from. And the reason I'm sure people were saying this is because she's come out before, prior to linking up with PJ Washington, She's come out before saying, like, trapping basketball players and getting basketball players and football players and rappers is so easy because they're stupid. She said those things. She's all for trapping men with children. <clears throat> now, granted, of course, he didn't listen. He ends up getting her pregnant. And once she has the child... She ends up uh, breaking it off with him. And a lot of people were kind of, I guess you could say, feeling sorry for him. And then there was others that weren't feeling sorry for him. But I think all of us, most people can agree that she pretty much set him up, was pretty much scouting him for a while to get, get with him, finessed him. And now she's, I don't know, getting child support off of him. And it's like in the six figure range. It's ridiculous. It's a it's a ridiculous amount per month. It's six figures per month. That's all I know. I don't know the exact figures, anything like that. But basically, she trapped PJ Washington and now he has a child with her. And she's getting a lot of money off of him. And I don't really have too much sympathy for him. Not because I don't want to have fellow sympathy for my fellow brother, but it's like if you see the information and you know someone is on that type of time and they really out here to get get your money, don't, why get them pregnant? Especially if young young in your basketball career, like why get them pregnant? You may have the funds for it, but why, why do that to yourself? But that's neither here nor there. The reason why we're talking about her now is because she is, she is truly deplorable. She is truly deplorable. You see the title of the video? Brittany Renner on the hunt for a stepdaddy to take care of her baby. That is sick. Considering the fact that she's getting money off the dude. Like, bro, that's, oh, she is, she is, she's the worst, bro. We're going to check this out, man. Appreciate all the love and support. Road to 60K, and, and let's see what this heathen has to say. Hey, y'all. Hi. It's officially stepdaddy season. Yeah, what up? I got the car seat in the back. Let's go to the park. <laughs> Don't let your baby mama or your baby daddy block your blessings. I know in theory it sounds good keeping the same person to have kids with, but that's insanity as well. So if it doesn't work out with them, it'll work out with someone else. Okay, it just will. That's how that goes. And trust me, I know it's ghetto. 
it is so ghetto being a baby mama and thinking about multiple baby daddies is scary but mm, me and my baby gonna be all right we're gonna be all right so we're moving forward onward and upward okay i know a lot of you are skeptical about talking to people with children but i can assure you the baby mamas now today we don't give a damn you can have them i have exited the rat race i am not a threat i want you to be around for a long time not a good time you can hold my son put him on your story i trust his judgment i really do i really really do i just want you guys to be happy i swear i do now i'm not a threat but you know i can't speak for the other 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 hoes that you don't know about you know maybe i'll never be in your favor <laughs> but i am here for it okay like people move on save the you should have got the ring first it wasn't gonna work out anyways it just wasn't gonna work out let's laugh together and let's raise this baby you know <laughs> oh it is ghetto it's so fucking ghetto <laughs> um in conclusion stepdaddy season big aura big lumber big follow through need only apply <laughs> i don't even know what to say to that like oh my god bro <clears throat> um people like that man you just gotta watch out for and i'm sorry that that happened to pj but this is a lesson learned, a life lesson. You don't sit up here and and really dive deep into someone that has have a had a history of saying some wild shit, not giving a damn, don't really care, only there to really make a bag off of other men. Like this, the same, the same nothing new here you gotta do your research on the people that you're investing your time with especially if you're having sex with them you gotta do your research because i I'm, I'm willing to bet no so there was somebody that was close to him that was telling him she is not the one and th look at this over here talking about stepdaddy season like bro this is that's sad that's just sad that's that's really not what's up she is one of the worst of the worst and i truly feel sorry for the child because the child's gonna have a mother that if she doesn't change her ways will forever be known as someone that not that's not wife material she she doesn't even come off as mother material she don't she just come off as money hungry material that's it just care about money like bro that's i i couldn't see how guys could even find that attractive she she can be the prettiest woman in the world but talking like that moving like that that's not attractive to me and trust me there's gonna be a simple-minded man that's gonna i'm willing to bet there's gonna be a simple-minded man that's gonna play the stepdaddy role oh i don't care what no one else say they're gonna pull a, a pj washington i don't care what no one else say i care about you and get okie doked that was that was disgusting she's disgusting that was that was awful bro that was i don't even have the proper words to convey my utter disgust like i said she's not for the streets she is for the sewage the pipes under the streets bro she is she's scum bro that's that's not what's up that's not what's up and any woman that agrees with that type of mentality 
you're part of the problem too. Any guy that agrees with that type of mentality, you're part of the problem too. Just as simple as that. But comment down below. Let me know. Were you guys repulsed? Because I was. Were you guys just as repulsed as I was? Because I literally, I, I couldn't say anything. Because it's just like, yo, she's truly vile. That's not what's up. Comment down below if you agree with me on my opinions here. And uh, appreciate all the love and support. Roll to 60K and fellas, 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 fellas. Just do your research before you lay in the bed with the woman, bro. Just make sure you double and triple check. This is someone that you're really willing to risk having sex with or even potentially getting pregnant. Always strap up if you ain't ready to deal with the consequences of potentially getting that person pregnant. But just, just be careful, fellas. Be careful, man. I love you guys. <laughs>